IVF Start turns 20 this year. Do you know what that means? Yes, it's been a whole decade since we joined the FSR. Impressive, half of the FSR life. It's been an incredible journey. And now it's time to look back and celebrate with our community. Let's start. A story I'd like to share with you is how the so-called online team of the Florence School of Regulation was born. It was in 2014 when the school decided to digitalize its activities and to move online. So Daniela and I arrived at the same time, having to meet big goals and to do so by following a few instructions. All the rest was left to our initiative. Today, the team combines multimedia, comms, web, digital, executive education specialties and benefits from the leadership and mentorship of the Schumann Center in each of these areas. You can find us online. We started our e-learning journey in December 2014, when I had just arrived in Florence. The first edition of the Power Sector course attracted 150 online participants. After four years, we had already developed 22 online courses, attracting around 3,000 participants. Growing this quickly could compromise our quality, but we navigated this challenge by creating standardized templates and KPIs. Chiara, may I now share a curiosity? I developed the first online course for the Florence School of Banking and Finance, and you created the first online course for the School of Transnational Governance. That's right. From an early stage, we started collaborating with the Schumann and the UI to expand our executive education portfolio. Today, the UI is a renowned institution for executive education, and these efforts continue to develop as we professionalize the team and our training offer. It's just a notebook, you may say. We produced this notebook for the FSR Global Forum, which took place in Florence in 2019 and gathered 100 experts from around the world to promote practical solutions on key aspects of the global energy transition. And for us, it meant a revolution in perspective from Europe to the world. In fact, since then, we contributed to the launch of a sister school in India and uh, the African School of Regulation, which will soon move to its African headquarters. I thought about what our secret is many times, and I really cannot tell exactly what made our journey so special. We were just a group of young people navigating through unfamiliar territory and eager to make our mark. Our motivation was not for recognition. It was rather a collective determination to do the best we could and support one another. Once I started having more responsibility within the school, I made efforts to ensure the team's work was acknowledged, leading the team to have a greater autonomy and a stronger sense of accountability. This spirit continues to be part of the FSR, and I'm very lucky to work with such amazing people. And now, are you ready for a scoop? Before the school started its activities, one of the founders of the FSR, Jorge Vasconcelos, asked the three esteemed colleagues to give feedback on the concept note for the establishment of a school of regulation in Florence. So we may say that these colleagues involved in the brainstorming contributed to the foundation of the FSR, its vision and scope. And guess who was one of them? The recently appointed president of the UI, Patricia Nance. And that's not all. In 2022, we also had the privilege of having her teaching a module on social valuation to our course participants in the regulatory delivery online course. We couldn't be prouder of this contribution and we couldn't be happier to have a woman leading our institute in these challenging times. If there's one thing I've learned at the FSR is that surprises keep happening. Every day I'm surprised by the dedication of the team and the remarkable results to achieve. The FSR 20 more is not just a catchy slogan, it's our mission. We do not know what the future will bring us, but we know we want to do more. We aim to expand our impact through our courses, research, events and our contribution to the energy transition. As for my vision for the school, I would like FSR to continue as a place where every member thrives and finds their voice. My wish? To cultivate a community that inspires lifelong learners and change makers. Together, we will shape the next 20 years and beyond. Dani, are you sure we will be here in the next 20 years? I don't know. Maybe. But I hope our legacy will. Mm -hmm.